Today we're going to be making a manual backup of your Scratch Live information. That includes your crates and the order of how Scratch Live should look when you open the program. For this example, all of my music is stored on an external hard drive. Wherever your music is stored, that's where your crate information is written to. So again, beneficial if all your music's in one location. Makes everything easier later. But in order to move that stuff, first we want to close the program. So I'm going to close out of Scratch Live, and on my desktop, I see the icon for my external hard drive. So I'm going to double click to open it. And when I do, immediately you see the underscore Serato underscore and underscore Serato backup. These are the folders you want. If you're using an older version, it might say underscore Scratch Live underscore and Scratch Live backup. You would take those. So I'm clicking on them, hitting Command C to copy clicking on my desktop and hitting command V to paste. Essentially copying them off the external, pasting them to my desktop. Once I've done that, I can close the external and I have the folders safely on the desktop. The program won't read them from here so they won't interfere. You can move them to another external hard drive or flash drive for safe storage or you can simply leave them here. That is your manual backup for an external hard drive. Any questions, let me know or head to serato.com. Thank you.